Hey y'all, today we're doing this silver and gray tribal stamp design. I'm starting with a slightly shimmery gray polish and that is Illyrian Sinister Haze, I'll put the link below, and OPI Push and Shove. This is the plate I'll be using from Uber Chic and I'll put the link for this down below of course. I'll be using this design right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to be using push and shove for the stamp. So I'm going to place that all over my image and I'm just going to scrape the polish towards me and I'm going to pick it up in a semi-rolling motion with my stamper and there it is. I'm going to line it up next to my nail and I'm just going to press it over my nail. And there we have it. There's the design. Then I always clean my stamper with a piece of tape so we don't mess it up with acetone. And I go in with my small brush and some more acetone and clean up all that polish that got on my skin. And finish everything off with my favorite top coat. And this is my new favorite, Shine XL. And that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed this. I really love how the silver looks on top of the gray. It's just a perfect match. I just really, really enjoyed wearing these. If you get inspired by me, use the hashtag magazine inspired on Instagram so I can see. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye! Hey y'all, today we're doing this holographic water marble stamp design. I'm starting with a few different color bases. I'm using Color Club Miss Bliss, which is a pink holographic, and Pure Ice Monte Carlo. And this is the stamping plate I'm going to be using. It's brand new from the Born Pretty store, and it has a bunch of water marble designs on it. But this is the one I'm going to be using down here, this big giant one. So moving right on into the stamp, I'm going to pour some of